Hey guys, welcome back to another exciting adventure. My name is Amy. Um, this is Amy Stone's Haunted Adventures and Explorations. I haven't quite figured that one out yet. I am at this really cool old abandoned silo. It's a farm and I've driven past it several times, but I haven't like, well, I stopped and I took some pictures one day and I posted them on my Instagram so you can check those out but it's really cool and I thought eh, might as well it's a nice day but I would stop by and take some more because this land is actually for sale I think it may have even sold I'm not a hundred percent however I wanted to stop take some photos take some video I'm just looking at where to stand you can see some of the ruin back there but it goes way back so I thought why not go back I might put on a different coat um, but yeah let's check this out can't be too too long this will be a this is gonna be this is actually because Ontario is in this stupid like well, I guess it's not stupid, but depends on who you talk to. Um, in this lockdown, stay-at-home order stuff, it's hard to get out to film. So I'm picking places that I can get to fairly easily. And I have no idea what the history is on this. Except that it's an old farm. And I know that the road has moved over over the years. And yeah, it's an old silo. And really cool and it's you know it is what it is so I'm gonna turn you guys around and let's just this is gonna be like a series like I'll probably po be posting these on Tuesdays and then any videos that I have left over from last fall and early winter I'm trying to get up on Thursday nights so I'm hoping to have these trail type videos exploration date more daytime stuff and I hope you can hear me because I have my hand over the mic but um, I'm hoping to have trail exploration type videos set for Tuesday nights that's the goal hopefully I can get to that get like stick to it um, but yeah I just want to pump them out grind out Got to keep busy because this whole thing in, here in Ontario is like getting on my last nerve. <laughs> so anyway, let's check it out. So I'm actually on my phone because I was driving by and I decided to stop and I don't have my camera with me. So I'm using my phone and then I'll just upload it from there. Cool. I love old stone. But look at the like look at the craftsmanship. And if you can imagine this is at least like a hundred year old. Like literally a hundred years old. You know, I should do a necrophonic. You know what I might do, guys? I might do a necrophonic. I'll screen record the necrophonic and I will add it in somehow, the audio. Because that would be kind of cool. I did that when I was first starting before I had a camera. So yeah, we can try that. That's cool. I love this old stuff. Like I love history. And I, oh, oh, there's metal. And something is attached to me. Look at that. See, I'm heading, <laughs> sexy, yes I know. Three unicorns, yes, I'm heading to the barn. So excuse the sexy socks, because I don't have my half chaps on. And my spurs. So that's, <laughs> I feel like rushed guys, so forgive me, I don't mean to be. <sighs> I'm just, yeah, I don't know been a crazy few days. I am right beside a road too, so. Oh, look. That's 
quartz. It's a nice big quartz crystal. Wow, that's actually really nice. I may have to. That's really pretty. That's a really nice piece of quartz. Hmm. This might have to put it there. It's really pretty. Really pretty. So there's a wallet go over there too. So this is like I said, sort of like at the beginning of the year when I came back. Um, this is going to be more, I'm doing, I want to do both, um, paranormal and exploration. I don't want to just do one niche because like the situation we're in at the moment, you can't really do just one because of the whole stay at home lockdown crap. So I want to be careful of poison ivy because we do have a lot of poison ivy around here. That's cool. I don't know what that is. If anyone knows what that is, mechanical-wise, oh, it's, it's really stuck in there. Hmm. Comment down below if you know what that is. People are probably driving by. Isn't that cool? To me, that's cool. I think that's cool. I wish I did know the history here. I could get the history, probably. But again, stay at home order, so contacting the local museum for information is probably, I'm gonna doubt that anybody's even there. Little bricks. Oh, this looks, just the way that it's piled. See how it's a circle? Hmm. Actually, see the bricks? Alright, so there's the bricks. And they go... Ah, okay. So, at first I thought it was a grave or something, but no, there's like free bar. There. And over there. I don't want to get in too far, but part of the wall there. So this is, I don't know where the house would have been. I don't think it would have been this close to the barn, to be honest. It's old metal, something or other. I'm assuming that that's water. Shut up, I'm gonna try to get this one up for Tuesday. I missed my deadline for a video last night, which was Thursday, because I've been back and forth with my dad to the hospital. Nothing too, too serious, it's just trying to get something of his fixed. <laughs> I'll just leave it at that, and it's going to have to require surgery, but there's no, unless you're like falling over dead surgeries, they're not having this at the moment. Hmm. Not much really to us to look at, to be honest. But this is probably tick land. You can get into that.
Oh, there's a house over just to my right, or sorry, my left. Good people there. I was watching South Cacks little message on Twitter today, and you know what? He makes it, he's really cool, like a really nice guy. Like they are really nice people, and he makes a lot of sense. Like I've got to stop worrying about worrying about the numbers and just edit, just video edit, pump, pump them out, get them up, find that niche, find that what makes you stand out, and just just keep doing, just keep doing it. You know. Holy fuck. Hello? I don't know if there's anybody here. I was just exploring. I wanted to take some photos. I don't want to disturb anyone though. You guys, I don't know why the camera is like mistyish like that, but what do you think? Should I climb up this thing? Actually, looks like it's gonna rain too. This is like a little commune for kids, <laughs> or some really crazy people. That's my thoughts on it. I'm gonna climb up and see. This is scary, man. Scary. Okay, I'm up top, but the floor is very sketch. People have not been up here for a while. Oh, Canada. That tarp would have covered that. So this is abandoned. Although I suspect, and I'm gonna tell you why I'm not gonna go up. I don't know if you can even see, but see the floor right here? It's buckled. There's no way that I'm going to go in there, especially if it's just plywood. Nope, no way. Beer cans, water bottles. Oh, a lot of junk. Pretty ingenious, though. Cool place to hang out as a kid, I'm sure. Yeah, the sad thing. So there's a road there, but the sad thing is that this is all going to be um, houses, I would say within the next few years. I d don't know if this is haunted, but I don't have my regular camera with me, so so I can't, it's too hard to do like necrophonic. And then screen record that, and then, yeah, it's too complicated. <laughs> I'll just leave it at that. It's too complicated. I'll have to come back. But this is kind of cool over here. See, even more. Looks like that's where they had campfires. There's a chair, tarp, barrel for burning. All these trees have fallen over. This is a pretty cool find. Who knew? This is what happens when you go off the beaten path, guys. 
I just hope I don't get in trouble. Oh, an old car park? Come here. Another platform. Some kids put a lot of effort. Excuse me, it's kids. I don't see why anyone else would do it. But they put a lot of effort into this, that's for sure. How do I, the heck do I get out of here now? Number one question. Because this is, you can see that. I'm gonna sink in that sucker. Hello, did I walk through you? Never mind. Maybe not. <laughs> I don't know, to be honest. I thought I went that way. Yeah, so there's been people back here. Guaranteed. Because that was too big for my footprints. Hmm. Scary. Actually, really is quite scary. To be honest. When you're alone, you have to... It's, it, it's a little sketch. I would not recommend coming alone, but you know what? It's, well, I think you can, you can die in the middle of the day. That's pretty cool. It's falling apart though. Definitely falling apart. Oh, you did. Oh, boy. Culvert. Over the little creek. I'm gonna go back. Okay, so I wonder how I can get this edited. YouTube from my iPhone onto Windows. Oh, fiddle heads. You can eat those. It's not yet, they're not ripe. Okay, how do I get out of here? This is what I do, guys. <laughs> and you know what's funny is that a lot of guys that I've got, come out with. Filming, non-filming, whatever. Cool. Hard wire. Um, they're like, oh no, I can't climb through there. Like, you just gotta work your way through. It's called problem solving. really quite sad that this is sold off for development because there's a really pretty field there. Hopefully I don't get in trouble for being back here. Back in the day this would have been really nice property because you got the creek and then the farmland is right there and back there. Here you would have had your home. It's just weird because the barn is actually right up close to the road. Now they could have changed this to the road, but who knows? Stagnant water. Okay, guys. I'm not really in this video, but I saw it and I wanted to film it because you just never know. So I'll catch you guys later. Bye.